Hey guys, so I'm often asked how we go ahead and use the uh, Vimeo uploader tool, so I thought I'd make a quick video tutorial showing you how to do it. Now, realistically speaking, you really need the, uh, you might want Git to actually get the software, but we can just grab it um, from the downloads from uh, github.com slash tomnomnom slash video uploader slash downloads. I will put a link in the post below this video. Uh, we're going to get it as a tar GZ. And uh, what we actually want to do is, is download this to our Linux box. So here we are on the Linux box. In uh, I'm on as root at the moment. You could do this as your own user. I just This is a development environment, so it doesn't matter. Uh, I'm in home Jose Vimeo test. I'm actually going to do uh, wget and then the path to the tar.gz, which is here. Copy link address. Bada bang. Grab that. Okay, so that's now downloaded as master. So one of the problems that I do have is uh, is this kind of issue where I have to move this master to uh, let's say vimeo.tar.gz. Then I'm gonna extract that to. Okay, so all we've done there is download a file and extract it. You can see that this is now in here. I'm gonna actually just move that into this root folder. Now usually I'd have done git pull and then the path, um, but not all of you guys are going to be git users, so if you are then do git pull, if not then do it the old school tar gz way. So now we've got this, uh, all these files in this folder, you'll see that we've got, we can get rid of the tar.gz, and we've got a readme file in here that'll tell you how to get started, so let's jump onto uh, the Vimeo website and look at how we register an application. Now, I've actually already got a uh, an application registered. Uh, oh, you can see that they've actually removed they've moved the page for new applications. So, what we'll do is we'll log on to Vimeo. Okay, and we then go to. Uh, Oh, they've, they've changed everything. Yikes. Okay, fear not. We've always got trusted DuckDuckGo. Vimeo upload um, API. Actually, just Vimeo API, possibly. Yeah. Okay, so let's go here and then let's say. Okay, let's switch back to the old design. So this is obviously temporary. And then that's not helped at all. Okay, so they're obviously changing things. Um, let's go help developers. Here we go. Uh, okay, then full, uh, full documentation on the advanced API, then your API application. So yeah, that was a bit of a farce. Um, I'm going to have to hide these in the video. This is the consumer key and the uh, consumer secret. It's something that you really shouldn't show other people. Um, so, yeah, I'll have to just edit that out afterwards, but that's not a problem. So, we're going to go into here and we're going to register a new. Um, so, register it, register it here. We're going to blah, 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 blah. You've got to be pretty specific because they're going to be fussy. And then that's going to give us a new key. So once we've got a new key, what we're going to have to do is um, copy the config example code. So copy config.example.ini to config.ini. We're going to then look in here. We're going to go back in. Then we're going to grab the consumer key. Pop that in. We're going to grab the consumer secret. Pop that in. And then we're just going to run the authorized process. So save that. Yep. So to do that, we just run scripts authorize. And it'll give us a URL. We select this. We create a new page. We click allow. And it'll give us a code, copy that code, paste it in, and there we go. We're all set up, it worked. 
So basically once we've done that, if we want to upload a single video we just do php scripts upload single and then say the video file that we want to upload. So let's say we'll use a test one uh, which is in um, somewhere is it in here. Well, you can imagine, you know, we've got a test video file and we uh, we basically just point that at, you know, video.mp4. We'd hit enter and then that would upload the video up to Vimeo. So it does take about a week for the registration process with Vimeo to, to uh, be completed as well. But this is a great way of just uploading videos and that would do a single if you want to upload in bulk, uh, upload multiple. And then the path, which would be say home, Jose videos, something along those lines. So that's how you get started with the... Uh, Vimeo uploader PHP class, I guess, I don't know if it's a class or a tool. Um, have a play, see where you get to. Hopefully this is a massive improvement on where we were before and a great way to break free of the shackles of YouTube, if that's how you so desire. Um, there are a number of um, YouTube download all of your own videos to your, uh, to your local hard disk. Uh, and those applications should serve you really well. Um, you can see it's only taken five minutes to get started. So yeah, have a play. Thank you.